Like, let's say you play uh, an Olimar and you're like used to Olimar things. You play another Olimar, they like, do a different whole different game yeah. plan. They can't throw you off. Yeah, that's very true. Like, I mean, MFA is definitely like a diehard Olimar player, so like. He he's might use an Olimar. He, he, I guess so. He's an Olimar. <laughs> All right, let's see how oh, this goes. Hey, hey, has one yet. It's, it's, oh, oh, what's going on? Yeah, yeah. Oh, Naji. So, thank you, Naji. So now, um, yeah, he has two. I'm not sure what to say about the set. I really don't know much about both of these characters, especially the Olimar. Um, I know what Karama's looking for, and that, that's, that's it. Yeah. It's zero to death. Eat smash. <laughs> <laughs> For real, I mean, close to make Karama look uh, broken or whatever, uh, yeah. godlike. I mean, to be honest, though, if you watch any Karama set, that's that's what he's doing all the time. Yeah, Doesn't matter yeah. what type of player you are, how strong you are, he's always getting those confirms. MFA is struggling to get a hit on Karama. Be really evasive, really smart with his approach. He's not getting hit by that many Pikmin. Yeah, um, I mean, he's gotten a couple like purple Pikmin tosses here and there, but. <laughs> Like, Karama's just kind of kept uh, kept his distance. Yeah, and he's just bringing very small to approach this MFA. He's gonna have to try something different in order to get in a bit of damage. Over the, down an entire stock game, over that 100%. Yeah, uh, I mean, I know Olimar can do a lot of damage, especially with the purples out. Like, yeah. that was pretty smart, actually. He's waiting for the air touch. Yeah, I mean, he, he basically just did. 40% in two hits, like... Man, is this Steve talking about, or... or I don't know. It kind of feels like it. <laughs> I mean, we with this damage... With Purple Pikmin, is like Diamond Fair. Yeah, for real. And the thing with Purple Pikmin is, like... It, it's just so hard to contest with. It is, and man, that backer is also so hard to contest with either. So, I mean, I mean, as well. And all more backer taking the KO. MFA is gonna have to take two whole stocks of Karama. One of the best models in the world. I don't know how he's gonna do it, but... It's like very, very hard. And you know, they actually have a crew battle next uh, Monday, so. Oh, really? Yeah, they do. Between Reno and Sack. So I'm really interested to see how that's gonna go. There's like a preview of Yeah, a little, a little bit of a preview. <laughs> I swear we didn't see that. We didn't know about that until today. I swear. To, I swear. I mean, I'm definitely gonna try to watch that uh, crew battle. Because with, with this match? And. Wow. Why oh, he's still alive? Immaculate DI for MFA. Yeah, he needed that. Um, I, I I think with MFA right now, um, he needs to get on the ground to get some pigments because you can't just do it with the purple. Yeah. Like he's he's not getting a chance to get on the ground. Well, now he is. But. He is. He's not poking. Now he is. This is scary, man. I mean, yeah, it kind of looks like he's kind of flailing, like with the the down bees. He's, I think he's trying to armor it into like a reversal, but and Karama the, waits those out every time. Yeah, yeah, and the, and the upper connecting. Karama taking the first game pretty solidly over MFA. MFA's going to change up his game plan in order to, um, in, or, in order to get game or set, or, or the set, because Karama looks very comfortable. MFA kind of spread it in on how to get in and how to kill. It's just. This is one of those things you have to figure out as a top player, you know? Yeah, like, I'm sure we can get, like, his footing on this game because Karama opened it up with a zero to death the first game. That's so true, that's true. He was kind of playing on a deficit for the entire game. But now it's back to being even. I think uh, he definitely has a little bit of a plan, uh, game plan. And uh, hopefully we don't repeat what we said on the commentary track. I definitely don't want to curse another uh, early stock from, from MFA. And man, those uppers taking on throwing a lot of damage. This is honestly one of the first times I've seen that play in the league. Yeah, uh, he's definitely gonna enjoy this league while he has it. And Karama's punish game is so good. But you know what, MFA? Those Pikmins, they do a lot of damage, man. It's yeah. Like, it really count a lot. Yeah, like, I think he's doing a lot of better uh, job, like, um, kind of controlling the mid range. Because, like, Karama, before, he was just kind of, like, getting in whenever he wanted to. But, like, now he's just kind of, like, he's kind of forced to play a little bit slower. Yeah. And uh, that's pretty good, especially an uh, aggressive player like Karama. Um, I know MFA has a lot of fans, so like, they're all watching this right now. This top 32. The fact that these players made it this far is pretty impressive. A lot of good players today. Yeah. I mean, if you look at the bracket, it sounds like it's fake. Dark, Lizzy, Vito, 
Karama. Louis Money. Yeah. MFA. It sounds like a fake bracket. Like I made it up. I am but MFA taking that stock zero zero. Yeah. This is uh, MFA had a little bit of a lead. Oh, that's big. Oh, that did not reach. Yeah, he's definitely regretting that one. Oh man, he could have got an easy sixty percent from that. Oh, uh, so oh my god. He's just Dude. not getting anything. Like he, he keeps on getting reversal by that up B, and he's not getting his up smashes for the combo starter. Oh, and the yellow pigment on him? Well, that's crazy. That's, that's, that's crazy. Oh wait, but th things are looking no better for him now. Like yeah. he still has control over center. He has yellow pigment, which has much, much more than this one. Yeah. Uh, it's definitely <laughs> he's just he's on anti airing with that back air. Oh, and that was a good mix-up. Oh, that's not gonna be enough. Yeah, what that was that. I, I didn't even know what was gonna happen. Yeah, they're 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 kind of nervously scrambling near each other. It's only a matter of time before one of them takes a start. Wait, he threw his only perfection. That's that, that's a lot. That's huge. Yeah, I think uh, that might have been a mistake. Oh man. Oh, he yeah. tried to armor through the back here. Wait, from waited out just in time in order to get that punish. Yeah, that's crucial in the Olamar matchup. You know they want to use that. Um, down beat to re reversal you or just armor moves in general. It's like Shulk uh, Shulmanado. <laughs> yeah, in a way. It, it's a zombo version of it. Except it's much easier to use. Ooh, and Karama goes for a big fair try to early, uh, end the game early. The face, struggling, man. He loses that stock and it's hard for him to bring him back. 54% and counting. Yeah. You should kick this uh, stock of Karama immediately if you want to touch it. I feel like with MFA, he, he's definitely a player that, like, needs the lead. Because I, I feel like with, whenever he's on a deficit, it just kind of feels like Karama just does whatever he wants with them. Oh, oh my god. god. Yeah, you can't punish that uh, up smash with F smash. That up smash is pretty... He knew it was coming, and he just threw it out there. I mean, that's so, that's so smart. That's how confident he was in his play. Yeah. I mean, the back air into up, up smash was a pretty smart move from Karama, just because the back air is so safe that um, it's really, it's like you want to hold shield versus it. You don't want to try to challenge with any move afterwards. And same, same match, same character, same stage. It's looking, it's looking pretty Karama favorite. Uh, I don't know what MFA does here to be real with you. Well, we'll see. I mean, MFA is a top player, so we'll see if he could um, make some. Uh, some we'll need an adjustment to this. In this set. Bunch of killers, man. Top 32 in the regular playing Karama. That's, that's rough. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, and that not KO. Almost so good. The I from MFA. Anyone else? They would have been dominant. Yeah, MFA. At the very least, he knows how to DI his uh, the Mario upbeat confirms. Because if, you, if you're not DIing those, the, those will rob you so early. Oh man. Wow, but Karama always waits out the whistle. He just knows. I don't like snake your They're disadvantaged. You know they're gonna, they're gonna do it or delay it. Yeah, it's like their strongest like uh, disadvantage option. But when you're playing versus them, it's like the thing you have to keep in mind the most, you know? Yeah. Karama shield is very smart, does not want to get purple. He's trying to, he's trying to get that shield back. Oh, and the spot goes down smash, he's not going to go in. That was purple, imagine that spike. That would be crazy. And that's a. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, um. Uh, I'm gonna say. He's looking really solid in this game. He really is. I think he could. I, I think his game, current game plan is definitely working. Yeah, definitely. I think, uh. Oh, wait. Well, yeah. I have a plan just get thrown out the window when you have the punish game just as strong as Karama. MFA though, answering back. This guy has uh, some fight in that thing. Is that it? Oh, and the oh, whistle, so smart. Yeah, that whistle, um, I don't think Karama could have waited that. Oh, oh man. And he hit. Yeah, this is huge for MFA. I think this is definitely his chance to get a game on the board. Yes, I know, and uh, Karama just they didn't grab him. I mean, it's just... Oh, I don't think he has enough upbeat gas left. No, he can still have a ticket. Oh, wait, they run out of... Yeah, if you um, use your upbeat, it's kind of like Villager, but it doesn't show. That's so weird. Yeah, it, it's just like, it, it doesn't um, seem very... Uh, it's, there's no, like, indication. That's so bizarre. Yeah. You know what? MFA is running away with this game. 106% on Azure? Yeah, he, he, got, he got, like, that upbeat, like... 
death, and he's like, I don't even care. I'm just going to win the match now. Yeah. It's just... I want to say he's running him over because it's ultimate. You never know. Yeah. I'm afraid they get really comfortable. Yeah, with the purple out, too, basically any of these aerials can just kill. Oh, my God. In the punish game. Oh, that might be no, it. That's not it. No, no. way. And he steals it. Yeah, that's Mario with that rage, with the upbeat. I mean... <laughs>